Blue Lock is rated an 8 point, almost an 8.3 out of 10 on Mal. I obviously disagree, so let's get into why. In terms of negatives for this show, it, this, it has everything going for it. I can say everything in the book for a very predictable and extremely cringy, extremely tropey. All the characters are tropey. I've seen all these characters in different anime before. These these are all characters that we've all seen. If, you've, if you're familiar with anime or the anime format, you've already basically seen this show. You can you can almost call out what they're going to what, what their lines are going to be from the backstories to the the character development i said that with quotes uh, around the word development um <laughs> the way they win games it, it's it, it's all disgustingly over dramatic it oversells every scene in the worst way possible and they run through the exact same template for each episode or, or uh team they they go against it's it's you know in terms of negatives, this show has everything going for it. Every hurdle our main character faces, it'll start off positive. Uh, there's there's going to be a player that just gets unnaturally, unreasonably evil for no like. I don't even. <laughs> the way they depict like like uh, 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 an antagonist in this show is hilarious. They make these characters like evil, like they're serial killers. They give them these crazy eyes and wicked smiles to make them feel more evil and sinister. They're they're playing soccer. They they're not serial killers but they'll take a character give them this evil aura make them the uh, the antagonist and uh our, our our protagonist will start losing with no hope of winning and then in the game he'll just get or his team will just get a power boost an insane power boost this isn't a training power boost this is an in-game power boost every time that bro has trained the, the only two times bro has trained and it and it and it meant anything in a game is for endurance Damn, that's really it. because in a game the way that they really progress is just realizing things about soccer or about the blue lock system right they'll just realize things they're not they're not really getting better at shooting or or, or he's not or our character isn't really getting better at dribbling or or shooting or um um he's not he's just realizing things about the game or about his game while playing and that just makes him win or not get eliminated which is kind of cheap it's, it's it's extremely cheap maybe if i was 14 i wouldn't see any of this as cringy maybe i'm just growing out of the typical shonen format and now i'm an old man and i can see it all and i and i and i cringe at it and it's not as great as it used to be but there is no clever writing for the story and all the characters are extremely generic now listen i know about one percent of y'all have made it this far in the video about one percent of y'all have made it this far i commend you I'm going to talk about the things that I like now. I like everything about this show. Everything that I just said was negative. The 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 how how tropey it is, how overly dramatic, how cringe. It's hilarious. It's funny how how tropey this show is. How basic and predictable. It's funny. The show is extremely entertaining because of the pacing and again how tropey it is. It's 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 comic. It's comical. I said that right. I said it was comical. It it really is. I, I'm sitting here laughing. It's very entertaining. The show is very entertaining. I'm. I just went on a binge. I watched the entire show in two days. It's extremely entertaining. Extremely. The plot is different from um, other sports anime. I've never seen a, a sports anime with a with a similar plot like this. This is a very interesting plot. Um, the over dramatics are, are very entertaining. The pacing is good. I love the show. I love this show. And it's and it, and it made me and it made me reconsider what I'm doing here, right? What am I rating this? This is this because this is an interesting case. This is a terrible like this. This isn't this isn't a good show by any means. By any means, would this be a good show? Off rip, this show is like a three out of ten. It's like a three out of ten. There's nothing impressive. There's no. There's just nothing. The show doesn't really have too much going for it outside of the plot, right, and the pacing. And it has so many negatives, but it's so entertaining, and I enjoy it so much, and I'm going to continue to watch this show. And I'm waiting for another episode to come out. So am I rating it trying to be objective or am I rating it based off of personal opinion? Past videos on my channel, I've rated shows based off of if uh, if I found a show cringe like JoJo JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, I had to drop the show because I just couldn't get into it. It was too cringe for me. I rated uh, One Punch Man based off of that. I rated, I think that's it. I, I rated fa Family Guy based off of that. I need to take everything that I like into consideration when i give a rating i can't just give a rating based off of trying to be objective because that in itself is cringe i can't be objective i'm a human being with an opinion everything that i'm saying is opinionated i would give this anime 
like a strong six. To put that into perspective, I think I gave Demon Slayer a five or a light six. Somewhere around that range. I enjoyed this show just as much as I enjoyed Demon Slayer. It's, it's in the same boat as, uh, as Demon Slayer. For me, Demon Slayer is extremely entertaining. Um, this show is extremely entertaining. Neither of which are written well or don't have anything. You know what I mean? They're not. They're not. If you on paper, these shows aren't good. So yeah, that's pretty much it for Blue Lock. I did just want to give y'all this. This um, the positives. I think I'm gonna start doing positives for every show that I review because everybody in the comments just uh, assumes that this is a troll channel or that I'm just doing this to make people mad. Uh, I'm not. I'm just reviewing shows that I that I watch if I have an interesting opinion about a show that I think is different and that that is prov I don't know if I have a video worthy opinion then I'll make a video about it blue lock is very overrated but I still thoroughly enjoyed the show I think that's an interesting opinion but yeah that's all I got for blue lock um I'm still watching it at the time of this recording it's uh episode 14 so uh you know what I'm saying I'm, I'll, I'll probably update when the show ends and give my opinion then let me know what y'all think uh y'all have a good one